Welcome back, everybody. Let's go try to find some of those spell stones, or not spell stones, but the uh, power stones. This wolf of Olin. You can tell last episode I was kind of delaying for time just to make it an even 15. So you press the switches in the middle of the altars, uh, avoid the R2D2 droids. They shoot electricity at you and they hurt. So yeah, those little switches, they are timed, so ignore everything. And just go for the switches. Alright, and here. So there's three of them, and you activate one, you have to go around the place and grab these switches. That's nicely nicely animated switch. Uh, diamond man, or gem or whatever. It's a little animation. I did crap like that in school. It was kind of fun. I miss doing that. I wish I could do that more. Whoops. Yeah, we we had to make like spheres and squares and light them properly and you know put shading on them and stuff like that for uh, computer an or not computer animation but uh, graphical animation. Uh, activate this one over here. Okay, I know where that one is. So you gotta jump up on the crate here. Hopefully it won't close by the time I get there. They stay open for a fair, uh, fair amount of time. Especially if you know what you're doing, I think they stay open for a little bit. Oh, except if you have fire. Okay, I forgot about that. No, I guess they closed. Okay. I'm gonna have to go open that again. I think that's the only one that's got like the odd crap in the way, so shouldn't have to worry too much about that one. The other one's not so hard to get to. Alright. Yeah, see that's the problem with this game, is time doesn't stand still while the animation's going on. So, it can be a bit annoying. There we go. And we get ourselves the second crystal, green crystal, gem, whatever. No. Telling you folks, I have nightmares about this dream. Or about this picking up items thing. Just gets burned into my head. I just start sitting there humming it to myself every time. It's two down, one more to go. Uh, this way. I'll do the right one now. Ah, damn it, that is. See, sometimes it's hard to see the, uh. When, um. The spotlight on the droids. Whew, there we go. Light gem, all good. All right. So with all this, uh, yeah, I think it's over here we want to go. It's not even in the light. Also, pick up as many gems as can. You want your bar thing to be full? No, nah, want the wrong. Yeah. 
God damn it, stop lightning zapping me. Um, what the hell is it? Okay, that's the door. Damn, I'm looking for the power room. Okay, it's gotta be this one over here. Yeah, it's this one here. Uh, yeah, all the tricky stuff's gone, thankfully. Right, the door will open, it'll be full of gas. So you gotta do this quickly. Keep in mind, while these animations are going on, you're still losing health. There we go. That wasn't so bad. There's our little dinosaur Lightfoot friend who's just standing there. I guess he's gonna ride the wind up. Take that, mofos. I don't know if you can shoot them or not. There he goes. I don't know if you can shoot those droid things or not. Power is restored. I just got zapped. Head over to that one there. So they just like target you and hold in on you before you can do anything. So these switches, they're going to be an arrow. I don't know if you can see that clearly, but there's an arrow up or down depending on where you want the wind to blow. Yeah, there's nothing there, so... Beat the crap out of these guys. Show them what for. There we go. Come on. Thank you. I don't know how to activate the thing. I thought pulling back will cause him to spin the weapon around, but it doesn't. So these little patterns here, when you see them, I uh, use the sharp claws to uh, activate them. Yeah, so you gotta go around taking down these enemies. So. Little bit. There's a rabbit up there if you want it. I think there's five of these guys to take down. To be honest, there's quite a few rabbits here making it very difficult to really lose this game. Quite a few rabbits you can get, so. I shouldn't say not. I shouldn't say it's hard to lose the game, it's just. If you know what, if you know how to get them, it makes the game fairly easy. <laughs> oh, we got them all. All right, so this part opens, and you know we can't pick it up because you got to be a sharp claw. It's a special kind of bomb in this case. Go. Get used to where that is because you're going to have to deal with that bomb after a while. Come on. Don't worry, it takes a long time to explode actually. See, how come when he drops, when the machine drops it, it doesn't explode, but when I drop it. I hit it, and it got confused. Oh, I felt her. Uh, 
Oh, there we go. Thought you could sneak up on me, eh? I was ready for you. That's why you want to have a few gems left, is to be able to activate that. Although there's tons of gems here, gems here to like boost up your blaster thing. seems unstable. See if you can find a way of breaking it. Hmm. First of all, I didn't mean to actually jump down. I shouldn't have done that. What you want to do is you want to go to each side here. Flick a switch. One fire goes out. I think you can kind of figure out what's going to happen here and then what we're going to do. Should be fairly clear. Damn it! Can't roll into them either. And I went. I shouldn't have gone that way, anyways. See, the area is blocked over there, so you gotta schnick over here. Fire's lit. And there we go. So I think yeah, you should know by now what I'm about to do. Or at least you should see what I'm about to do. Thank God that hit. I was a little worried there for a sec. You all right? My children. When I was captured, they became scared and are now hiding around the fortress. <coughs> Please take this. Use it when you hear them. Its call will guide them back to me. If the Shark Claw find them, I fear they will leave the fortress forever. All right, we got our next assignment. Actually, we're breezing through this area pretty quickly, actually. A lot quicker than I had planned. Cool. So you can get an animation of where they're being... There's four of them, and there's a little gauge that uh, you got to find them before the gauge drops down and take care of this guy. Take care of the sharp claws. That's where you land. Damn, he's a good musician, too. I mean, Fox McCloud can do anything, man. Fly a ship, you can beat the crap out of people, you can blow crap up, you can play music. It's a sign of a true hero, people. Holy crap. Yeah, they'll get further and further away. Let me in. Same crap. Take care of the uh, two dumb claws. There we go. Wee dee 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 dee. And that one's kind of a confusing place if you should know where that is, but if you don't quite know how to get there, it can be kind of confusing. So 
please rate above us, but uh, we'll save them in the next episode, I think. So, folks, I'm going to end it there for today. Thank you for watching, and have a good day. Bye now.